Hey guys, Retro Badger here with another Enterprise. This is the Enterprise I. So this is the one obviously before the J, if you know your alphabet like I do. And it's pretty impressive. It's fitted with all sorts of weapons that I've never seen before. There's also quite an interesting backstory to it. It's currently available on Gamefront right now, so I thought I'd show you what it can do. To begin with, I thought I'd put it up against three Enterprise Fs, as surely it will be able to beat those. In terms of design though, it looks very different to the Enterprise J, so there was definitely a big change in design philosophy when they went to that ship. Okay, here we go. Now, I like the nacelles on this ship. They look more protected, if you know what I mean, more armour encased. So there's our new phaser array. If you fire a photon from the front, at least I think it's a photon. And we've got advanced quantums, type 12s. We're also equipped with other types of torpedoes as well, which I'll show you. I decided to go up against three original Enterprise Fs, as we've not seen the Enterprise F for a while, the original one, and I miss it. I'll show you what these inverse quantums can do. Yeah, the phaser array on this ship is cool. I like it though, it's not overpowered at all, this ship. Okay, here we go. Wow, yeah, look at that. We also have shields that automatically redistribute, which is a nice touch. You'd think at this stage they would automatically do that. The Enterprise I stage. It's interesting though, the saucer section is... Whoa, look at that! <laughs> saucer separation! Still going though. Yeah, the saucer section is streamlined, which is interesting because we see that on the Enterprise J to the extreme. I'm going to show you as well, there's another type of torpedo. The Hyper Quantum. I'll just ignite the plasma stream for a bit of fun. Wow, they're fighting back, aren't they, these Enterprise Fs? Let's fire these torpedoes, there we go. Ooh. Oh wow, look at that. You know, they remind me of the Connie refit refits a little. Hey, they're spinning around out of control, that's hilarious. Yet yeah, they're firing still. And we've lost our drive section. Brilliant. Well, we kind of won. Okay, let's try it out against Deep Space Nine. I'm interested to see how much damage our torpedoes can do. Oh neat, we can do... I like that full spread, that's really cool how it does that. Let's see what the inverse quantums do. I can't believe we lost our uh, star drive section in that last battle, that was unexpected. So it was a battle of the sources all over again. Oh, here we go. Oh man, that looks bad. Now I'm doing this against the regular Deep Space Nine version. The RBG DS9 from Hell is almost ready to be released. We just had a few technical issues, but I've almost resolved them all. So their tractor beam is having no effect on us at all. That is cool. Oh, here we go. What's this going to do? Oh, yeah, hang on. Yep, straight through. And I wasn't even aiming for the paddle plant either. That was just ops. Man. Well, this ship is currently available for download on Gamefront, and I'd highly recommend it. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Bye for now.